What's up everybody and welcome back to the channel. We are going to be doing a video on Gear Raid 3. It is only stage 15 now and I'll tell you why. I'll tell you why. Uh, purely because we are waiting on heroes that we want to 6 star. Um, obviously on this account, Araka, Lunaria and Aeona are the only 6 starred heroes at the moment. Um, we will start pushing other ones soon, but not just yet. But what's important to... Wait, hang on. Sorry. Nyx is 6 star as well, which is not max level yet. Uh, but what's important to add here is, is that this was being done when everyone was 5 star. We're not using Lunaria here. We ha just haven't needed to because the way she's been upgraded, I haven't added her into the team yet. So we will start to push stages soon. But for now, you can see how it was working with 5 star heroes. Obviously, Araka is, is huge with that extended range on the for piercing heroes. You would get the same buff from uh, Lunaria as well. Um, so, so bear that in mind too. But Brian, Theoin, um, Mari, Vortex, Nyx, and I think Nisande was deployed. Let me just show you the gear on the heroes. Even though the gear has changed quite drastically since, um, we are sitting at low crit rate, low crit damage, gone for attack on Araka. And on, we'll show Brian, we won't show Lunaria because she isn't in the team. Brian is on, um, it's, it's, we're not using the crit rate on her, just using some attack. Not amazing a gear, not amazing gear, still good though. Uh, Theo win, obviously as well, level 50. And he, again, is, at, you know, these are quite easily obtainable stats. These are flat stats on this hero currently. Flat stats, look, this gear is very easily obtainable. Um, Nyx is a little bit better geared, a little, little bit better geared. She is on 100% crit rate, an extra 55% crit damage, and 6239 attack. Attack bonus, attack bonus. And when we get the rolls, we'll probably start putting in some crit damage. Just haven't had it yet. We just haven't had it yet. Look, we're on, a, we're on a healing effect set here, purely because of the crit rate, attack bonus, and the crit damage and crit rate here. So bear that in mind as well. Don't always go for sets. Stats over sets, guys. Stats over sets. Uh, who else will we need to show here? Mari. Um, she doesn't really need the gear. She's not going to be doing much other than freezing the enemies. Maul won't be being used. But let's have a little look at the team here. So stage 15. We're going to go into auto fight now. And you can see the, the lineup. And don't forget, Araka is extending our range by one tile. As you can see there, Brienne coming straight in first. Araka going in the center here. Mari will be in the left here, so she can slow down these left enemies, especially when the wave comes in, the bigger wave comes in. I forgot, I forgot Hollow was even in here, to be honest. This is very early on. This was done with five-star heroes. You can see how easy it's being, you know, cleared now. But this was from five-star heroes. Nyx on here, just to clear this wave on the right side. Theo, Win and Mari together in the center on the left to slow when these enemies come in so that um, Araka can just clear them off one by one. Absen just came in because he was a, another hero that we could have used. So you see them getting slowed down. You see them about to get frozen. And I mean, they was dead beforehand. But when it was, when everyone was five stars, that was more important because obviously we needed to freeze there. It was like a, a, another acting tank. Crowd control was important here. Then we come in again, they're getting slowed constantly. Gives us time to attack from range of Araka. Another freeze there. So even with if you know they had a bit more time there, like I said, when was on five stars, you would have still been able to clear it because they'd have been frozen out of action. We could have nuked them down. And the stats on this was 2.5 million by Araka. I mean, I know not many of you are gonna have Araka. Um, but who could you place in the center instead? I mean, potentially Apsan, but Apsan to me is lacklustre. Um, Setram is a very good good hero on this, but he doesn't go on the ground either. So I don't know who you may be able to put. Just trying to think who else you could put in, in the centre there. Hang on. What's this? This is, this is attack bonus, crit damage. Oh, I have to use, this is actually uh, okay. Mm, shame no crit rate. What was this? Crit damage, crit rate, attack bonus on a flat health piece. Can you imagine? Ooh. This is how it happens, isn't it? This is how it happens. Let's have a look at what other teams are being used. Recommended lineups here. <laughs> King Haas. King Haas. Uh, but the good thing is, is that you don't need to be doing it with six stars. Once you get to stage 15, it is tough. It is tough. It's a hard stage. Um, but you can do it with five star heroes. Okay. 
see they're using Apsan. Um, it's no tank in this, is there? Wait, would, would I tank on the ground? He would go on the ground, so maybe he was taking some of the ground there. Um, uh, Dagna, okay, so maybe they did have someone holding it down. Uh, uh, popular Heroes, Hatsuit is obviously the one that you really, really want uh, for this. Nyx is very good here, though. Uh, Lunaria as well. I'm looking forward to using her just for that burst damage, especially against the boss. Um, Apsan is, 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 is lackluster, in my opinion. Brienne, I like Brienne here. Maul um, is okay, but it's a bit of a while to wait for his ultimates come back up again when those other enemies start to come through. So you need to make sure you've got it on point. Um, Karmet obviously set, yeah, yeah, these, these heroes are obviously going to be huge. But hopefully, that that kind of lineup helps you, gives you an idea of what you need to do, and using the likes of Mari and Theo when to slow down that left side it's very important, it does help a lot because you know it really takes away our, our focus on, on other heroes. So we can we can quickly kill off those other ones, and then we have time to kill those as well. Um, just thinking the right side, Nyx, obviously. You want someone doing that AoE damage like that to clear up that right side. Who could you put in place of that? I mean, would Hatsit do it? Would Hatsit do it? I think so. Uh, just trying to think of someone else. Well, I think of someone else. Comet. Comet should do it, right? Yeah, his ultimate would do it. Um, Aona, potentially, but then you haven't got the range. And again, Arica, having Arica here for that range extension, or Lunaria if you have her. Um, so good luck to you trying to clear your gear raid free, and hopefully that gives you some input on how to do it. Obviously, it does get harder with each stage. We know this, but hopefully soon we'll be able to clear some high-level stages once we start to promote some of our heroes. So I'll see all of you in the next one. If you've got any ideas on content that you'd like to see, let me know. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. Have a fantastic day, even wherever you are. Goodbye.